Okay, this is on the Pierce job, number 54205. Um, so what we're doing is we're replacing this furnace and adding a heat pump, replacing the AC with the heat pump. Um, so this plenum comes down, the drop goes away. Um, I have your cut lines on the back right here. So edge to edge. The furnace is going to sit back 20 inches from this back wall. We kind of drew, so this is the one edge of the furnace and this is the back of the furnace. And it's going to go 21 that way. Okay. So, new furnace, just as it shows. Furnace will sit on a 10 inch base. So, um, this is a big starting collar, six inch starting collar on each side, but Lance on the scope said he wanted turning vanes in it too. So I know we don't normally do that, but I'm adding turning vanes so you can stick them in there and see how they look. Make sure, just make sure the air is not gonna turn it right into the, uh, you know what I mean. Anyway, Return just as it shows. So behind the um, furnace, I have this U-shaped piece of duct for return air. So um, go to return air, those studs. Um, anyway, U-shaped duct on the on the back, and then tap 12-inch round into the back of here and then I gave you two 90s just in case you need two but um, might work with just one um, but anyway into that on the other side we will put a a 30 by 10 baseboard grill right there all right combustion air is okay there your vent gonna run oh so on the water heater vent you see it comes out and there's this dumb thing here so we're gonna get rid of this tee but just use these fittings um the existing fittings and hook back up the water heater without the tee um and you can probably do it with no other fittings with what's here. You can probably make this work. Okay. Furnace, we're gonna go two inch PVC out the back. Um, so, see your combustion here, so kind of go where you can. Um, so, flat termination in the back. Um, so the gas, just it already has a drip leg and everything. Just going to replace the flex and the piece that goes into the furnace. Um, AC. So you're going to flush the existing lines. Um, Lance has to replace six feet in here, and so I gave you. A, 12 feet of 7 8 rip techs. Um, new big pad. They have a regular 36 pad cemented in. So you can put this pad on top of the other one. Or if you set the unit down and it's missing the pad altogether, you can set it on the concrete. But I'm ordering you a big pad. Um, pull new shielded wire. Um, our Breaker is a 40 amp Siemens, needs to be changed to a 35 amp. So we'll set electrician to do that. Um, pull stranded, sorry, pull a shielded wire here and to the stat. Drains to the floor, standard order. 
Thermostat S40, bunch of wire. Furnace power, reuse box switch and cover. And then nuts to return air. I went over that already. Okay, and that's it.